Hey folks, uh, in the previous video we talked about the amazing benefits of rebounding. We listed the top 15 benefits of using a rebounder for about 15 minutes at home. In this video we'll go over the pros and cons of the top 3 rebounders in the market. Now there are a lot of rebounders out there in the market and it sometimes becomes quite confusing finding the right rebounder for your needs. So I'm going to simplify this process for you and I'm going to list for you top three rebounders in the market today. There are a lot of factors to consider when it comes to choosing a rebounder. Here we'll go over the top three and we'll list the pros and cons of each of them. At number one is the Bellicon rebounder. If you want to have the absolute best rebounder in the market regardless of the cost, then the Bellicon rebounder is the one for you. It is a German made rebounder and when it comes to cost it is high however it is top-notch quality so the pros of the bellycon rebounder are as follows first of all it is made of bungee cords instead of springs so it is extremely quiet if you are doing some rebounding exercising in your house and somebody else is sleeping having a rebounder with springs will create a lot of noise in the house this is not a problem with the bellycon rebounder the Bellicon rebounder is actually made in Germany from the toppest and highest quality of material. It has a durable structure and should last a long, long time. Uh, some of the problems with rebounders with spring is that the springs usually wear down and you have to replace them. The material is not uh, strong enough and you would have to constantly replace these parts. This doesn't seem to be a problem with the Bellicon rebounder. It is made up of UV resistant material and they have also used environmentally friendly material in the construction of the rebounders. And the reason I mention that is because some of these uh, synthetic materials that are used in other rebounders, they actually off gas dangerous gases, chemicals that when inside the house, they can cause some health problems. But that's not the case with the Bellicon rebounder. Now, in terms of the con, when it comes to Bellicon rebounders, I only see one, and that is the cost. These rebounders can range from $600 to over $1,000, depending on what you're getting. However, as I mentioned, the Bellicon rebounder is top of the class and the best in the market today. At number two, I would like to recommend to you the Jumpstart rebounder. The Jumpstart rebounder is also a great overall rebounder. It is not as durable and as versatile as the Bellicon rebounder. However, it comes quite close to uh, the Bellicon rebounder. It has not been made with environmentally friendly material, but it comes at a good price point for those who can't afford a Bellicon rebounder. It is very similar to the Bellicon rebounder it is made up of bungee cords which is a great thing and to pick exactly what suits your needs now in terms of cons the jumpstart rebounders are less customizable than the bellycon rebounder the other thing that i noticed with the jumpstart is that the bungee cord cover that is used in the construction of the rebounder actually folds over so this might cause a hazardous situation if you happen to put your foot inside and in between the cords and over the cover the other problem with the jumpstart rebounder is that not all the models are storable. The rebounder's legs stick outside of the rebounding frame. I'm not sure if this was intentionally done for the design but uh, I don't see that as a positive in a rebounder. Now the third and last rebounder that I'd like to recommend to you is called the Leaps and Rebounds rebounder. It is also made up of bungee cords. It is also a very good all-around rebounder but it lacks the quality and the customization compared to the top two rebounders. Some of the pros of this rebounder is as I mentioned it is also made of bungee cords and it comes at a very good price point for something that is made up of bungee cords and for those who cannot afford a Bellicon rebounder or a Jumpstart rebounder. The cons are actually a little bit more. The Leaps and Rebounds rebounder is actually a lot less customizable than the Bellicon and the Jumpstart. The legs of the rebounder don't fold up, so you're gonna have a hard time storing it. They actually screw in and screw out. So if you have a garage or somewhere that's a little bit more open to store your rebounder, rebounder uh, then that might work for you but otherwise you're gonna have to unscrew the legs every time you're using the rebounder and then screw them back into the rebounder when you want to use the rebounder again so these are the top three rebounders I recommend to all of you the Bellicon rebounder at number 
number one for the best all around rebounder. The second one is jump start rebounder. And the third one is leaps and rebounds rebounders. Now, if you're interested in any of these rebounders, we'll include the links below this video for you to check out. With that said, if you're still wondering about the great benefits of rebounding, please check out the video coming up on the right side of your screen. And please give this video a thumbs up. Do share with people that may be interested and please subscribe to our channel. All the best and learn from nature one step at a time. God bless guys.